Hi there, it's Chris here with SelfMadeNewbie.com and in this video we're going to go through the best dog backpack carriers currently out there today. Now I've kept this list as comprehensive as possible, narrowing it down to my absolute favorite five, so no matter what you're looking for, there'll definitely be something on this list for you. So before we jump in, drop a like and subscribe and hit the bell to be updated with new videos. All right, as usual, I'm gonna skip the fluff and dive right in. If you wanna confirm my recommendations, go in the description there and check out that list to ensure you get the best price. All right, so the first one on the list is gonna to go to my recommendation for the best for small breeds. This is the Kurgo Nomad Carrier Backpack. So this isn't your average run-of-the-mill backpack, no. This is the James Bond of dog carriers, only for the elite small breeds under 15 pounds. Think of it less as a backpack and more as a luxurious doggy penthouse with straps. Some of the key features, a waterproof bottom, because who likes a soggy bottom, right? A doggy clip, it's like a VIP lounge tether for your pooch, and extra space for, you know, dog treats or your own snacks, who's judging? And transformer mode, it's a carrier, it's a backpack, it's both. And a peekaboo window, your dog can now judge people silently from its mobile throne. And easy cleanup, because even dogs appreciate a clean room. And full coverage as well, for when your dog wants to play incognito. A few cons, needs more breeze, it is like having a convertible but not putting the top down. And also lacks sort of Bear grills features, no waist belt, so you know, don't go climbing Everest with it. So who's it for? Well, if you're the type that enjoys a stroll in the rain with your pint-sized pooch without turning it into a wet dog smell contest, this is for you. Perfect for the urban adventurer who enjoys cafe hopping with their furry espionage partner. Not recommended for the hardcore hiker or anyone planning to trek uh, through the Sahara even, unless you fancy turning your dog into a hot dog. The next one on the list is my recommendation for the best for medium breeds. This is the Canine Sport Sack Plus 2 Dog Carrier. So this is the absolute Rolls Royce of dog carriers for the medium sized tail waggers. This isn't just a dog carrier, it's a first class seat for your furry best friend designed for the canine equivalent of jet setting around the world or you know just the local park. Some of the key features, a detachable storage bag, like having a mini suitcase for your dog's essentials. Weight distribution, it's like the doggy version of a perfectly balanced seesaw. And mesh side pockets for when your dog needs that extra bit of breeze and snack storage. Also cooling panels, because no one likes a sweaty back, dog or human. And anti-fur zip tech, say goodbye to the horror of zipping up your dog's fur. Also comfy straps, it's like giving your shoulders a nice little gentle hug. And tail friendly base so your dog can keep its wag on. Also a rear facing dog position that's easy for your dog, checkups and surprise treats. A quick con, fit fiddling, might require some strap juggling to find that just right spot. So who's this one for? Well ideal for the urban explorer with a dog who likes to be in on the action. If your fairy friend is the type who loves being the center of attention, and let's face it, which dog doesn't, this is your go-to gear. Just remember, it's like a puzzle. A bit of adjusting is needed to hit that sweet spot of comfort. Not quite suited for the ultra lazy dog or the owner who thinks adjusting straps is a high intensity workout. The next one on the list is my recommendation for the best outdoors, and this is the Kurgo G-Train Dog Carrier Backpack. So this is the SUV of dog carriers, rugged, ready for any terrain, and it looks like it could survive an apocalypse, quite frankly. Perfect for the outdoorsy type who thinks a walk in the park is actually scaling a mountain with their four-legged sidekick. Some of the key features, well, waterproof, because a wet dog in a bag is really just like a walking, barking rain cloud. And sturdy as a tank with interior fiberglass rods, because sometimes dogs need a fortress. And a safety clip, so your dog doesn't bail when you're not looking. Also some neat disco strips, reflective light uh, for those late night disco hikes. And peek and hide window for the dog who loves a game of now you see me, now you don't. Also a strap bonanza, adjustable everywhere because one size never fits all, cushion for comfort, like carrying a dog on a cloud, and an extra compartment for everything but the kitchen sink. A few cons, reverse dog position, and also stabilizing rod shenanigans. They're like trying to solve a Rubik's Cube blindfolded. But who is this for? Well, this is for the adventurous soul who believes a dog is their best hiking partner. If you're the type to climb mountains, ford streams, or traverse vast wildernesses with your fairy buddy as your compass, this is your holy grail. Just be prepared for a bit of a tussle with those stabilizing rods. They're not for the faint of heart or short on patience. Not the best choice if you prefer a leisurely stroll or have a dog who enjoys facing the same 
same direction as you. The next one is my recommendation for the best for older dogs. This is the Apollo Walker Pet Carrier Backpack. So this is really the luxury retirement home for the more seasoned dogs, you could say. It's like a portable spa day for your aging canine companion, ensuring they can continue being your trusty sidekick on all your adventures but in the utmost comfort. Some of the key features, mesh windows galore because your dog deserves a panoramic view. Internal leash clip, it's like having a built-in butler keeping your dog secure. A comfy interior padding, light yet tough as well. And ultra padded straps, so it's like carrying your dog on a cloud. Also sternum and waist support with this one because you know, your back's probably had enough. And dual side pockets for treats because old dogs deserve the most. A quick con, this is a little bit bulky. It's like trying to fit a small elephant into your closet. But who's it for? Perfect for the devoted dog owner who believes age is just a number. If you're the kind who wants to ensure your older pup still gets to enjoy the great outdoors without feeling left behind, this is your golden ticket. Not recommended if you're more into the compact slide under the seat kind of carrier. It's more for those who value comfort over convenience. A bit like choosing a luxury sedan over a compact car. And the next one on the list is my recommendation for the best airline approved. This is the Mr. Peanuts Aspen Series airline approved backpack pet carrier. So this is like the first class cabin for your canine companion, ensuring they fly in style and in comfort. It's the perfect accessory for the jet setting pet and owner duo, turning heads at every airport terminal. Some of the key features, 360 degree mesh view for the pet who doesn't want to miss a single thing. And storage galore, side pockets for water, a strap for sunglasses, and even a sneaky compartment for your ID. And a comfy fleece pad, because pets do deserve luxury as well. It's airline approved as well, obviously, and foldable design, it packs away like a magician's trick. Multiple entrances as well, it's like a fun house for your pet. And seat belt attachment, because of course, safety first. A quick few cons though, it is missing a chest strap and also only in gray. It's like having only vanilla ice cream, basically. So who's this for? Well, ideal for the globe-trotting pet owner, of course. If you're the type who can't imagine boarding a flight without your four-legged co-pilot, this is your go-to gear. It's like giving your pet a first-class experience while you're stuck in economy. Not so great if you're looking for a fashion statement or need that extra chest support to balance a wriggly pet. All right, so those are my recommendations there. Hopefully there's something on that list for you. If you do have any questions, drop them down below. And if you found value in this video, drop a like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one. Take care.